This is Inelia Bins and I'm here to tell you about sex, love and soulmates in the new paradigm. If you've ever wondered about how it is that we relate to each other, how it is that we relate with our own physical bodies, the way in which we communicate, even through the clothes that we're wearing, how we wear our hair, and how that in turn creates your own reality. And if you've ever wondered why there are so many people out there, but that perfect somebody you just can't find, or a perfect somebody, or many perfect somebodies, seem to be out of your own sphere of reality. These thoughts will go deeply into that and how you can expand your own awareness, your own conscious decisions and ability to see in order to be able to access that expanded reality where those individuals exist. Reality is something we create every single day, not just by our conscious decisions, but also by our unconscious decisions. So one of the aims of these talks is to make all those unconscious decisions and ways of behavior become conscious so we can take a look at them one by one and then make conscious decisions and act from a place of awareness so we can choose what we want in our own lives and how we want to experience reality. I had a lot of fun during these talks on the creation, the entire production of these talks, which were recorded live throughout six days. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy them too. In this course, there are six different calls. On each call, we're going to cover very specific topics. The topics are going to cover are one, falling in love our social program of love and how romantic love affects our lives at an energetic and evolutionary level, how to increase the pros and remove the cons. Two, the separation, understanding concept and construct of other in relation to love, having a physical experience in the old paradigm versus the new paradigm, the main differences and what defines a physical experience. Three, does a soul have a sex? The difference between a soul, a spirit and a physical body. The creation of the sexes and their ultimate aim. And also the urge to have sexual intercourse. Four, gender as opposed to sex. We're going to be looking at the construction of gender at different levels, as well as sexual orientation heterosexuality, homosexuality, bisexuality and asexuality and how these are related to our gender and to our physical, spiritual or soul sex constructs. 5. The urge to find the one. Here we're going to be talking about twin souls, twin flames, manifesting the right partner and identifying what right is for our own lives. Six, dropping the dream. And how difficult this can be. The catch 22 to manifesting your perfect relationship. 